Collection of fans descending upon the stadium for what promises to be an absolutely riveting FA Cup final. Stay with us, we'll have all the action for you live right here on EA TV. At long last, the wait is over. A warm welcome to Wembley. This is Derek Ray, joined in the commentary box by Stuart Robson. And we're approaching kickoff time in what promises to be a spectacular FA Cup final. It is Manchester City, and they take on Sheffield United. Well, Derek, as a youngster growing up, this was the day that every young footballer dreamt of. Playing in the FA Cup final, walking out in front of 100,000 fans at Wembley, broadcast around the world, it still brings a tingle to my spine. And I'm really looking forward to this one. And here's the Manchester City lineup. Ederson begins in goal. Nathan Ake plays with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Kevin De Bruyne plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And the lone striker today is Erling Haaland. Holland. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Bergen. An awful lot of green space to run into. But nothing comes of it. Holland. creative look about this and well, they stopped them in their tracks well if you're the opposing defender you've really got to keep a weather eye on Erling Haaland what are you expecting to see from him in this game Stuart well he's their leading goal scorer because his space awareness in tight areas is so good he just has that knack of knowing where the ball will drop and I'm not sure you can teach that very quick thinking there De Bruyne, chances on, well if only he had timed his run slightly better, offside. John Fleck. The shot looked promising, but the keeper had the measure of it. Erling Haaland. The ball with Rodri. Patient enough build-up. Can they carve out a chance? Well, trying to take their time, but not enough care on the ball. Can they trouble the opposition this time? Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Teammates available. well blocked poor pass under no real pressure Berge Norwood still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead it was always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball Grealish Snuffing out the danger. Well, they're sitting ever deeper. Went in strongly, decisively. And slipped through by Ilkay Gundogan. Well, here it is again. The little one-two starts it all off. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. And the ball 
moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Gundogan. Well, great read there to intercept. John Fleck. That needs an accurate cross. Holland. De Bruyne now. Space on the flank. It's a perfect challenge. And City recovering possession well. He's in with a chance. to it and there's the delivery relatively straightforward to mop up defensively being egged on by the crowd oh he couldn't outwit the keeper well the keeper had to intervene under a bit of pressure there Max Lowe. Berger with it. McBurney. Good use of advantage by the referee. Oh, he wasn't ruthless enough in front of goal. Keeper has it now. De Bruyne. Holland. And they've given him too much space. Holland. Vital intervention. And I think we were all wondering what the verdict would be. The answer, a yellow card, Stuart. Well, he's just about got away with that one. It's a good foul in the end. That's a great stop. Well, his reflexes are so good there. That's a fantastic stop. Can someone get on the end of this? No trouble at all as far as the keeper was concerned. Well, it could be on for him here. Really important tackle. And a fine stop. Kevin De Bruyne with the corner. Well, he had the reading of that delivery, but couldn't find the target. And with that, the first half comes to an end here at Wembley Stadium. Well, advantage City after the first 45 minutes, but a long way from being decided. Promising looking attack. McBurney. Can he get them level? Well, trailing, but plenty of time left and a corner coming up. Trying to deliver it accurately. Oh, fantastic effort. He made great contact, but the keeper more than equal to it. They take it short. Targets available. Cross comes in. Thumps clear.
Well, they've won possession back. What can they do from here? Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? And they've Holland! And a goal! I'll tell you what, they're going to be very hard to catch now. Name on the trophy, maybe. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back. And then Haaland finishes it with such quality. Just look how much power he hits this with. It's a top-class goal from a top-class player. So 2-0 now. Showing good defensive judgment. McBurney. And this would reduce the deficit. Still possibilities. Well, nothing untoward happened. Given away by City. Well, foul play, says the referee. Not messing around with that clearance. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. McBurney. And he read it well defensively. Well, City haven't bossed the possession, as you can see. But their counter-attacking has been really good, particularly in the wide areas. It's been an excellent performance from them so far. Making sure nothing untoward happened. This could pose problems for the defenders. Now the task is to remain focused. And hit with real authority off the bar. Go kick it'll be. A change in the offing for City. Number eight, Ilkay Gundogan. To be replaced by number 20, Bernardo Silva. Silva. On to Holland. And that puts them in position. Being egged on by the crowd. A smart stop here. Played over. But no one latched onto it. Is it going to be? Well, the keeper had a lot to do. Well, it's a great piece of goalkeeping. So quick off his line. Possession seeded by City here. City move it forward with purpose. Grealish towards Bernardo Silva. That's all they can conjure for now. Oliver McBurney. 20 minutes to go. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Offside it is. Such a pity for him. Well, he thought he was onside, but I think the assistant got that absolutely right. Time for a change then. Given away by City. Low. Berger with it. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Well read to win possession back. And attempting the through ball. Sharp. John Fleck. And that a play for a Sheffield United throw. It's a corner. 
And over it comes. Opportunity. And oh, it's in. We cannot declare this contest over. They still believe. Well, when you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area, and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. So back underway at 2-1. Tight contest here. Trailing as they are, they're not likely to get too many opportunities late in this game. Ten minutes to go then. Given away by Sissi. Moving the ball forward with purpose. Oh, lovely ball. Sharp. This could be the equaliser. But no, when your goalkeeper comes up with a save like that late in the game, you have cause to be thankful. Well, that could be a key moment. They have to take those sort of chances. They won't get too many more, but let's credit the goalkeeper. Straight forward for the keeper. A very effective challenge put in. Now can they create something? And tossing through. In it goes! And surely that's the end of the story. They cannot throw us away from here. Again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. And then the strike from Grealish. He never looked like missing, did he? Brilliant finish. Underway again with the score at 3 1. Well read to put an end to that attack. And good use of advantage, the referee allowing play to continue. Well, wait, don't go anywhere. We're going to have five additional minutes. Beautifully disguised ball. Well, it was easy on the eye, but the interception was made. That's a useful cross. Well, it didn't happen for them in attack. An important interception. John Fleck. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real 